What's going on guys? It's your boy Nico Scotty and I'm back with another video. Look, I know liquidity pools and liquidity pool tokens and liquidity pools and liquidity pools, liquidity pools and all that could get confusing, right? So here is a specific video on it and I got a little cheat for y'all, man. A little a little something that DeFi Kingdom specifically have. I don't know if any other exchange has it, but let's get right into it. So Scotty Jr., we got our nine jewels. And if you remember last time, we deposited six tokens into our pool, right? We went into the jewel one pool. All right, let's manage it. 0.0012 is locked. 0.0004 is unlocked right so what does that mean for starters unlocked is what you can use right now it'll go to this balance and your locked here will go to this balance right so cool we got the breakdown of what unlocked means what locked means and what all these numbers right here on the screen mean right but this doesn't look satisfying and this doesn't make sense to somebody who's putting their money into this and trying to make money, right? So what we have here is called a watch, right? This mm -hmm. is other website for DeFi Kingdom. It's like an add-on for the game. I'll put a link within the description for you guys. Um, and you guys can just use it. You connect your wallet to it and you click on a personal watch and it will show you your whole overview of the money that you're making on DeFi Kingdoms, right? So here you can see the grand total is $53.99. My jewels that I have available is nine, which is worth $38.10. And then I have the locked jewels, no way, which is worth this much amount of money. And then the garden in total, the ones that we put into the liquidity token is worth $15. So I have a total of $53.99 and the value of jewels and one token. When we get to the garden now, this is the pool that we are invested in. When you start compounding and you start pulling your unlocked jewel and trying to put it back into your pool with one tokens and whatnot, these numbers will start increasing. And what these numbers are here is just the total of what you'll be making based on the APR rate of jewels that it's producing, right? So you'll see that for the day, it is producing 40 cents. For the week, it's producing $2.81. And for the year, you're making $146 just by putting money into that liquidity pool, right? It's gonna change based on percentages and whatnot. And, but you're getting some of the unlocked already. So you're reaping some of the benefits before the game ends and before it changed. So you can kind of create yourself a strategy to kind of make money based on this. And that's what I think is really cool. So boom, we got that part of liquidity tokens down, right? Check one. Check two of this is you staked it in here. You got your one and you got your jewel. What if you want to go ahead and just, you know, sell it or like, Get your jewel back, get your one back. All you do is here, you click on withdraw and it's confirmed, right? The situation here is that you have your tokens pulled out of the garden. You can take them to the marketplace, go to the druid, see your liquidity and manage it. And the way to pull it out is that you'll see that you have one jewel in here and then you have 22 Harmony 1, you know, because of the fees that was from pulling it out of the garden. And you can just remove it, or you can add, but we're gonna remove it with Scotty Jr. And then, voila, you complete this transaction, you get your jewel back, you get your one back. All right, boom, so you see the balance update. So now your Scotty Jr. available with jewel it's back to 11 and that's how you unstake your liquidity pool token so i think that should cover everything about it uh i hope you guys enjoyed this video i hope you guys were able to learn something it's not financial advice just guidance and thank you for rocking with me